So we got we got some stuff dropping in the news, and <laughs> someone dropped someone dropped a new album. Tory Lanez, he <laughs> went, he went uh, Corinne Stephens and dropped a tell all about the incident, quote unquote, from his point of view. Have, have y'all listened to it yet? Not one, not one song. Uh, just, I heard that. Um, I guess the initial track. I didn't even know it was an album until the day. I thought it was one track. I heard yeah. the first track then I guess. I ain't even going front. I ain't listen to it either. I don't plan on listening to it. Um I just honestly I don't see how people could actually could actually listen to it just because the optics is you know so much stuff is about optics. It's bad looking these days. It, it's bad it, it looking. It looks bad like people like people have been on the internet saying this, saying that. It was to a point where pe- Megan had to come out and say you know what? Y'all saying I didn't get shot. Y'all saying this. Y'all saying that. So I'm going to say it straight up for you. Tory shot me. We yeah. haven't heard from, we haven't heard from Tory since. You was the most popping thing on the internet since March with Quarantine Radio. You was all on every single platform. We, we could find you everywhere. Now all of a sudden, you disappear and how you're going to show up is drop an album? Yeah, fam, I ain't really trying to hear that. And I don't care, like, whatever excuse people say, ain't no way that I can just go ahead and just believe that, you know, is I don't know who, like, in, in this, with this platform would make up someone being shot by another artist. Yeah, that's wild. That's wild, right? That is crazy. I mean, we've seen some crazy things in this industry before, <laughs> like, <laughs> We've seen some wild things now. We we lived a little bit long to hear about mm-hmm. some wild things and to see some wild things. But the one thing that we that we do know that she was shot. I mean, she said she was shot. She showed her foot that she was shot. She was shot. You know what I'm saying? Now I do understand he has a right to tell his side of the story. Like I say, we ain't the court of we ain't the court of law or none of that. But what I ain't gonna do is the first time I hear from you is listen to this album that you're trying to profit off of. And and we need real answers because you can spend whatever you want to spend by you know humming and, and harmonizing whatever you got to say. I ain't trying to hear none of that. None I of mean, it. It, it is it is what it is. Some people, some people actually can separate the music from the people and the actual actions and all that. And the older I get. I I can't some some things I just can't I can't condone or get down with. Like I said, he got a chance to actually vindicate himself and you know do whatever he got to do to tell his side of the story or get his the get his truths out. But well, like, the album ain't gonna be yeah. <laughs> where I get his truth from. That's that's just that's it. That is what it is. And, and that's a fact. And and to piggyback, I I came at it from the. The total opposite side of the spectrum that you did, Hill, but I was looking for the same result. So, uh, you know, he was on Twitter yesterday saying that he had time to talk. So I figured that he was going to, like, say something. Like, like, go, it's like go live. Yeah, like, it really tell his side of the story. But it ended up being a song. So I'm thinking it's going to be one of these Nas type songs where I told you everything. You feel me? <laughs> I laid it all out. And it's. It's a lot of empty bars in there talking about, you know, dope, the typical hood rap song. All of that is still in there. And I, I didn't listen to I didn't know it was an album. Once again, I only listened to the first track, but I'm listening for answers or at least your side of the story. And I'm hearing like just hints or clues and, and not enough to be, you know, so it's like to me, if that was your chance to come out and tell the world. You did a bad job. And if we had to listen to a whole album to get your side of the story, you was never going to get that. You had one song to try to win people over. And I think you messed it up, man. If you really wanted to talk and you really, you know, I I wasn't there, so I don't know what happened. And and I'm I'm completely 100% sorry for whatever did happen to Meg. But let's just say for one instant that he is innocent. If you had a chance to get your side of the story out, why would you come with songs? Yeah, and and, and that's and that's where he loves me at. So it's just like it, 
if someone is accusing me of shooting them, I'm, I'm and telling I did the not, facts, and, and I did not shoot them. I'm, I'm going to facts. come out and say, like, no, I, you're completely wrong. I'm not going to be silent. Not like, at all. What, you, what sure ain't gonna harmonize it. you ain't going to harmonize I'm it. damn sure not going to be crooning over how I didn't shoot you. And on, my, top of that, and on top of that, let's say, let's just say for hypothetical reasons that, you know, say he's 100%, his, his, his side of the story is, is actually the truth. Let's just let, say. let's just say that, right? Mm -hmm. You mean to tell me that you dropped this album that it, that's probably been done? Ain't like yeah. you, mean, you know. What I'm saying? You mean to tell me you dropped this album on the wake of we just getting the Breonna Taylor non justice? That, yeah, that was about, that was about to be my next. That was gonna be my next point because, like I said before, it's all about optics. That's what I'm Especially saying. Especially now, I'm really not trying to hear from you now. Like yeah. I've listened to like I, I listen to music. But I'm not trying to hear no music from someone who's accused of shooting an unarmed black woman. Like, but bro, to, Hill's, to Hill's point, if he even for the slightest thought that his side was 100% true, he would have been said something. Or well, could have waited. I'm, I'm, he he waited this long. <laughs> but I'm just I'm saying, not, you, wouldn't even, you wouldn't even wait this long. If Like the data, like AJ said earlier, when she came out and flat out said a few weeks ago that Tori shot me. Nah, I, I can't I can't ride with that. I'm sorry. Unless legally they're telling me something different that I need to be quiet. But other than that, if I can make a rap album and talk about it, then I could have came that's out and just my laid thing. the facts down. Because exactly. so like, like people were people because when Tory was initially quiet and not saying nothing, people were talking about it's an open case, and you know you can't talk about yeah, open case. Yeah, but you rap. Well, if it's an open case, you damn sure shouldn't be rapping about it. But hey, but, guess what? I mean, it, it, it is what it is. Like and you say, people, I, people, listen, they say it's a good album. You know, like you said, the boy is talented. It is what it is. But like I said, what, it, until we get the actual facts of what actually happened in that car and what happened, is, he done, he done for me. Like I say, I ain't about to like, I ain't gonna say I'm about to fall off, cancel him. Like you know, mm -hmm. but I'm definitely, I know for a fact right now, he done. Gonna be mad at you if he did, bro. Like, and here, here's my thing. Like I. Like, Tori, like he's cool, but like I don't have to listen to your music. Like, listen, you like, I, like I, I, I don't. It's it's plenty of artists out there that I can listen to, and I like like if you you being accused of something like this, and then you come out and make an album about it, it's not something that I'm really trying to hear. Yeah. It's really not, and isn't this isn't this isn't me trying to put myself on like this pedestal and get a pat on the back by saying I'm not listening to his music. It's just me personally and me morally, the principles that I stand on, I can't I can't support this. I mean it's hard. I definitely ain't bumping the album. I tell you that much. I never have bumped the album of Tory Lanez's anyway. But <laughs> I, I will say that uh, a couple weeks prior to that, one of the one of the Virgo twins and Audrey, I can't remember which one, did put me on to um some of Tory's music. And I was, was like, oh, I, I, yeah, and I was like, okay, I've been sleeping on Tori. He he was he is more talented as an artist than I was giving him credit for. But I definitely I, I was doing without your music anyway, so I'm definitely not about to just listen to your music. So this you is easy. To, so uh, this is easy for you then, Candy. So this then, is right, easy say, for me. So like, so okay, let's say let's say for example, let's say this is T Grizzly. This this situation happened to T Grizzly. I'd be so, disappointed because that's my dog. Exactly. So so then, what would your stance be then? I'll be trying to figure out what's wrong with him, man. I don't think I would just turn on him because he made a mistake, even if it is a, just a brutal mistake. I don't turn on my people unless they bite my hand. You feel me? And that's, that's, me. And, and that's the difficulty that I guess that some people do have because they did rock with him. Yeah, and then I ain't, I'm not is. mad if you rock with him. You rock with him. People I'm make mistakes. Like He's not a perfect like person. Music. But to me, morally, it's just something like, bro, there's like, I don't care like what, like, you shouldn't like you shouldn't point a gun at a at this woman. She she didn't have no weapon, and I don't like I don't care if she's talking about you. I don't care what. Ain't like your original excuse where you know rumors were that you apologized because you did it because you was too drunk. Well, you don't need to drink. You get that drunk where you point a gun at somebody. And see and, the people who, and like, here, here's one thing that bothers me. Uh, what's bothering me is a lot of people that are coming out saying, oh, we don't know all the facts. We need all the facts.
But y'all the same people that get mad when the police officers come out and say, well, we don't know all the facts. We need to investigate the facts when an unarmed black man get killed. So you can't have it both ways. You can't say, oh, I don't, I need to know the facts. You I can. need to know all That's the America. facts. But then come out and get mad at somebody else for saying, hey, that's we don't know all the facts. Because that's, that's the same thing that they told us when they said when Trayvon Martin got killed by uh, George Zimmerman. But we don't know all the facts, so we don't know why. No, like, to me, if so, if someone does not have a weapon, why are you firing a weapon in their direction? Mm -hmm. That's true. But to your point, uh, uh, to, to your point again, Hill, if I found out that Grizzly was a multiple offender... At some point, I gotta cut them off. You feel me? I can't. I can't just con keep condoning it. Like I feel like it can happen to anybody. Maybe one time, people make mistakes and people aren't perfect. So I don't think you should abandon or just stop rocking with somebody that you rock with for a one-time mistake, even if it's a big mistake. You feel me? Sometimes people make big mistakes. It happens. But it's I feel like I if they if they can. I, I'm not saying me off uh, with the toy thing. I'm just saying that this was Grizzly. So if I was looking at it and I say like, all right, then if he continue to put himself in those type of predicaments with women and the same outcome keeps happening, I will have to say I can't I can't rock with him, even but, if he was my dog. You but you me? also even though your first your first step, though, is show contrition. Yeah, I need to know what's wrong with you. Like, what's what, what's going on, bro? You wanna, yeah, you want to see that your first statement ain't going to be no damn album. You ain't trying to hit mm. that from T Grizzly. You feel what I'm saying? Like, some of your optics got to be way better than what you're doing. You're like, absolutely right, Wayne. Right there. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's, 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 here's, here's a good example for me. Go to, man. Here's, here's, a good, here's a good example for me. And, and you know, I, I, I'll wash my hands with this. The Joe Budden rumors about him, like, uh, beating to hear. People ask me, like, yo, you fuck with the Joe Budden podcast. Mm -hmm. and this is true. You, you going you to quit listening to it? I said, I can't, I'm not going to support him, especially after all the stuff that he has talked about, about people putting their hands on women's and stuff like that. And I understand that people can change, but also it's just like, I need, I need to know, and I need to understand, and I need to hear it from you. Like what's going on? Like tell your side of the story. Cause you have that opportunity, especially mm -hmm. because you have a platform and yeah. he came, he addressed it. He talked about it. And, you know, even even though some of the verbiage that he used, I still didn't like. But at least he didn't run from it. He didn't just sweep it on the rug and start talking about stuff or, you know, just releasing stuff as it is. He actually spoke about it. The thing that's like so iffy to me is like, bro, we haven't heard from you. You haven't made a statement. People are talking about, oh, but y'all still listen to this artist or this artist. Right, someone talked to me about Chris Brown. Multiple people. I've seen it all over the Internet. But Chris Brown, he's like, he sat down and he talked, he talked about it. He he released a statement. And even in that situation, it's just like Rihanna, the, like the victim, said, you know what? We are cool. I forgave him. We are friends. And that's how I feel. Like, if, like, I'm not going, like, if, if the victim doesn't hold any ill will to you, like, and they, and they can show, like, and they can show, give you forgiveness, I can understand that. But for me, this isn't necessarily about hating Tori. I just not. I'm not about to support a piece of work where you're trying to profit off of it. I, I'm 100 with that. I hate when people. I hate gimmick albums anyway. Like I don't like that type of music. Yeah. So it's like, bro, that's a gimmick album. If you're talented, put out some music, bro. But you need to have cleared and rectified whatever was going on with this because you ain't said nothing since the beginning. So. You still ain't said nothing in my eyes because I ain't listening to that because I listen. I gave you one track to explain yourself and it wasn't good enough for me. So, um, well, my thing, my thing before we transition, uh, AJ, because you know how we we do, we rock with the Joe Budden podcast. And the first thing I said when the allegations hit, I said I would hate to have to. I I really hate to have to stop listening to this. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. I said that. I said that. So I gave I gave him a chance to say his side of the story. But if he if his side of the story was iffy. Hey, it is what it is. I gotta find another podcast. Like, I mean, yeah, you know, my, saying, like, my podcast. I got, I got plenty. I love podcasts. I got plenty out there, but you know, it is we what it is. We got to stand for something, but I mean, we still in that bubble. We still in that bubble, baby. You uh -huh. know, and doing things you can't believe. It's the three man we We come at you with topics. Yeah. No, you cannot stop it.